Let's discuss NetSuite customizing dashboard portlets. First of all, what is a portlet? Here is our dashboard from the home page, and you can see each of the squares that show data, fields, or graphs, those are portlets. We can add, remove, or rearrange the portlets on our dashboard. We customize the dashboard based on what information we need and tailor it to fit our daily tasks and how we work. If we want to see our profit trend, we can put it in the dashboard so every time we go to home in NetSuite, it's right there. Let's show you how to rearrange our dashboard. Go to the bar and locate the Move button. Hold the Move button in the bar while dragging it and position it anywhere in the dashboard. The move button looks like a four arrows that are going out. Next, we're going to show you how to remove the portlets. Let's say there's now a new release that came out regarding NetSuite. It's telling us about it, but we really don't want to see this. We can go to the top right corner and change the settings to remove the portlet. You hit remove and it's gone. Here is a shortcut portlet similar to the shortcut button in the navigation bar. To remove it, just go to shortcuts and select remove and it takes the shortcut out of the dashboard. We can also customize the portlet graph setting. This portlet is the top five customers by sales. We can change all the graphs by different periods or show selected graph types. There's a drop down menu where we can select how we want to view the graph. So here's the portlet graphs setting and we're showing you two different graphs. One is the sales by customer for the month to date. And you can see here that if there's no record, it will say no data available for this portlet. The second graph shows the top five customers by sales for the previous rolling half year. And you can set it as a bar graph, as charts, whatever way you want to look at the graph itself and the information. 